Hello guys, welcome to Helpful Solutions and let's begin. Of course the dollar sign signifies that a framing of reference. So when you use the dollar sign to of course show a reference, it doesn't matter where you move the object or the of course cell, it will always look at the same place. So it is an easier way of just referencing a cell. Let's say we want to do a sum or a multiply. We will just do and first of all select the dollar sign. You can do this by Alt 4 in your keyboard. And after doing that, I will do let's say B. When I do dollar sign B, dollar sign 2, you will see that it automatically chose the B2. And after that, I will do multiply and then say dollar sign b dollar sign three that way when i press enter doesn't matter what i do it will always be able to just do that as you can see doesn't matter where i move the object it will always use this frame of reference and it will always be correct but let's show you guys how it would go out if i did not use the dollar sign so you understand the significance of it I will just choose my B2, then say multiply, B3, yes, at first the number is same, but what if I just move it like a few cells down? It changed and chose B4 and B5. Because I moved it two cells down, the code moved two cells down as well. And if I go even more, it will change with the numbers because it will go down until it cannot find any more cells. That's why the dollar sign is that important and that's why you should always or at least most of the time use your dollar sign fully and correctly. That's exactly how it works and we hope this video helped you guys. If it did, don't forget to give us a like and yes, maybe even subscribe to our channel, Savvy Professor. In any other case, we hope to see you guys in the next video as well. Have a great day and goodbye.